Today's big question, why do Americans call casual sports shoes sneakers instead of trainers or plimsolls like the British do? Well, since moving to the United States, I've come to learn that most of the country in fact calls them tennis shoes, while here in Chicago you occasionally hear gym shoes. Sneakers is more common in southern Florida and the northeastern United States. The Boston Journal indicates that the term was around as early as 1887 and fell into use because the rubber soles were so quiet on the ground. They allowed the wearer to to literally sneak up undetected. While surprisingly the word sneakers did make its way to Canada, Australia and New Zealand, it did not, unlike other Americanisms of the time, catch on in Britain. Instead, in the early 20th century, the British began calling rubber-soled canvas shoes plimsolls, a term still in use today. And that name came about because the band around the lower part of the shoe reminded people of a ship's plimsoll line. Ironic then that between Britain and America, plimsoll and sneaker got lost in the pond.